I have worked for with chiropractors on and off for close to 15 years, and I've gotten some really amazing adjustments that completely resolve whatever reason I went in to get adjusted. And then I've had times where I've gotten adjusted and the pain gets worse or the symptom returns really quickly after the adjustment. What's the deal? What's the deal? Uh, I don't really know exactly because it depends on the situation, but from my experience is that it, again, it depends on the situation. So if you had something you went in that was a short-term problem where uh, it's a minor ache or pain or something that just came up and you're getting it treated right away and maybe all it needed was a little bit of therapy, a little bit of movement, and that took care of it, okay, there you go. Um, however, if on the contrary, if, you're some, if you came in with a long-term problem you've been dealing with on and off for several years and it's ca causing a significant drop in your ability to function and the pain level is, is significant um, and you've already tried maybe a lot of different things this is a, a more difficult problem and we're gonna have to take some time to make sure we're diving in there and doing the appropriate things to make that change now in those situations it's about the destination and about about the end game and not about every individual treatment so when someone like that, to expect that I should feel great when I leave that appointment, that first appointment, that should that can't be the expectation. And it may even be that you may feel worse after before you get better because this is a complicated problem. We're testing some things out. It's the first time I met you, I don't know you, I don't know exactly what you're, what's going on with your problem. But as I learn, as we go on with treatments, we'll be able to narrow narrow it down more and more and I'll be able to give the appropriate advice. So yes, I, would, I want everyone to feel better as soon as they leave, sure. But is that always going to happen? No. Sometimes in the path to success, you might get a little bit worse or it takes some time in order to get better. And that path to success is not a straight upward line. It's ups and downs. It's a roller coaster ride. Just like we have different days. We want, Sometimes we wake up and we feel like crap and we just have an off day, right? Where some days just feel like a hundred bucks, right? It can vary. And so how uh, treatments and a treatment plan and how, how you respond to that on a per visit basis can be different. And the beginning of the treatment plan is gonna be different than the latter part of it. And again, the goal in mind is the, or the, the we need to focus on the end game, the, on what the result is overall, not just in how I feel right after the appointment. Great knowledge. That's a great thing to know that during some therapies, rolfing is very similar to that, that we're gonna see ups and downs and ebbs and flows. And pretty uncommon that uh, chiropractors and um, physicians would come out telling us that there's going to be some upset and some pain, some discomfort, but it's really about the end game. So it's okay to feel a little uncomfortable in the process, but just to trust the process. Yeah, exactly. Trust the process because it's problem solving, right? How often do you solve a complex problem and you just nail it like that? No, tough problems take some time. It takes a little bit of guess and check, cause and effect. Try this out, see what happens. But if it doesn't work, it still works because that information helps us lead us to, you know, the, the path of righteousness, the path, you know, the, the destination. So it not working is working because we know what doesn't work so we can find out what does. Exactly. It's working. It didn't work. It's working. Gotcha. It's working for us to get that information that we need, right? Because unfortunately, it's just not as simple as in, you know, taking a blood test or and getting an answer. It's not as simple as, you know, uh, whatever else type of test it may be where it just tells you what it is. It's not how musculoskeletal problems work. It takes some testing and communicating with your body and some working together as a team-based approach in order to figure these things out. And that's why so many people struggle uh, with problems. That's why back pain is number one cause of uh, leading cause of disability and why we've thrown opioids at it because it's easy, right? Throwing that stuff at it is very easy. It makes people feel good. But as we know now, there's a huge backlash that comes with that. And that's what we're dealing with in this country. Great. So just because I didn't feel immediately better after my session doesn't mean it didn't work and uh, to keep on trusting the process. 100%. All right, great.